Okay, hi, it's Peter here, and I'm just going to go through now making a uh, Facebook campaign for your uh, class. Now, Jo has written to me and said that she's um, starting a class in a week or so, and so far she's only got a couple of sign-ups. So I said I'd try out a, a Facebook campaign in her area. So while I'm doing that, I thought I would just record it so that you can see how I do it. So she's in um, Alveston, uh, which is up in Scotland, I believe. And so the first thing we do is we go to our um, ads campaign. And of course, you have to have a, a sign up for uh, a, a Facebook ads uh, account. And I've got these different ones. Um, and so I did try one out in Weasley. It uh, didn't go so well, but I'm, let's try one in, um, in Alveston and see how it goes. And I have no idea how this is going to go. <laughs> so uh, I'll record this, I'll add to this in, in another couple of days to see how the results are. So first of all, uh, once you've logged in, you, you, first of all, you create a campaign. I've already done that, so I've got my campaign. And then you create an ad set. All right. Now we will call this Alveston. Hope I've uh, spelt that correctly. Let me just check. Yep. So, um, let's see, it's associated with this Facebook page. I, um, you can have a personal account. So I've got mine associated with a page, but you can do it with a personal account. Um, you can ask a Facebook expert, by the way, to help you address this up. And here's where we want to change. So what we want to do is we want uh, here Alveston Alveston, England There's an Alveston in Tasmania as well actually. Yes, that's correct. Now I'm going to do like 8 kilometres so I figure we'll try eight and see how we go. Because uh, I figure eight kilometers, people would be willing to drive about five to 10 kilometers to, to visit this class. So at the moment it says 17. I'll get rid of Australia, we don't need that. So again, Looks like we can't go less than 17, so... Okay, so it looks like uh, you can only go... We could do current city. Um, Alright, so I'm just going to do the current city. So I'm hoping that will uh, keep it very tightly around... Um, Joe's um, area and then the targeting can be uh, 18 probably a little bit older often the people who come to meditation lessons are sort of 25 and older so let's say 27 and older uh, men and women often women are more likely so you might want to target it to women but I would leave men in there as well um, so here, meditation, we want uh, people interested in meditation, so should only be 11 to 22 leads, uh, we might do something else, um, spirituality, yoga could be mindfulness, uh, people interested in mi mindfulness might be interested. Um, 
personal and spiritual growth perhaps. Um, so it hasn't really increased the numbers there, but anyway, um, I've got those interests. Automatic replacement budget. So I'm going to do $10 a day. Now I may not um, spend $10 a day if it, if it doesn't get the clicks. And that's about it. Okay. So now um, I actually honestly find probably the single image is the best. You can experiment with videos and slideshows and carousels, but I'm just going to use a single image. And here's the logo. We don't really want that, so I will add uh, a couple more images. What have we got here? Images, um, meditation. So we're going to look for a nice uh, image. That's a bit washed out. This one's quite good. I like the colors and the sharpness. This one is quite good. That one's not really going to be helpful for Olveston. Um, so we might go with this one. So I think that's uploading now. Uh, I'm going to add a couple of images. I'll try that one. Uh, this one. And I'll get rid of the logo. And uh, I can even use the one which this one has been quite popular for the leaders program. Anyway, you find some, some good images. Um, and now what to say. So uh, new meditation group starting in Alverston. Um, and join us. Right, so this yeah, it doesn't have an E on the end. Just checking I got the ads. Right. Um now the display link well we could put her page in here which is this I don't think it would let us do this whole link um, so we might have to just do this we don't really need that in there So medit meditation in. So we want people that to catch their eye to read the name of the place where they are and meditation. So meditation and Olveston are the key words. So I've put that in the headline as well. News feed link description. So this is. Um, Possibly, this is like mobile news feed, so there are different versions. So for example, here's in um, a phone, this is on a desktop, etc. Instagram. So we'll do that. Um, now, when is it? 
So it's starting on Mondays and Wednesdays in Market Street. So I'll add those details. Mondays and Wednesdays in Market Street. Now, call to action. Uh, I like learn more. button. Now what I want is I really want a form feed. Um, yeah, here we are. Lead form. Okay, so what you want, uh, when you create an ad, make sure it's lead generation. Lead generation. And this will give you a chance to create this thing called a, a lead form, which gets their details. It's really, really useful. Um, so uh, I think I can show you it. One knows and one says, learn more. So what they do then, we'll duplicate this one. So I've already done one similar. And you have the intro. Uh, so we give them the main points. To Market Street Alverston. Um, I think I'll actually just take this out. Short, shorter is better. So 1.30 on a... Oh, Mondays, 8.30pm on a Wednesdays. Do your body, mind and spirit a favour. Come and try us. So it looks like this. Uh, Questions. So this is important. We want their email, their full name, and you want their phone number so that you can give them a ring or a text. That's really important. You want those three. No more because it gets too onerous. And the good thing about this is it will actually pre-populate um, this form with their details. So they can just press submit. Um, privacy policy. Um, so I've got policies already in here. I think you have to have, uh, I'm not sure about this, you may have to have a page with your own uh, terms and conditions. You can use skillfulmind.com.au slash policies if you like, uh, or you might have your own. And then a thank you screen, we're ready to go. And then this, the, the website, so we want to go to her web page. And that's done. All right. Form type. Good. All right. So I'm going to finish that. Oh, so we've just, um, ah, I've, this, I wish this was called Olverston. Um, I'm not sure if we can edit it now. Anyway, it's too late to edit. You might be able to edit it later in, in your forms, but we'll have to just remember that form is reasonably lead form copy. Um, so then confirm that. Now you should have three ads with three different pictures. So it'll try the different pictures and see which one is going to work. Alright, 
Now you're going to have to, so here they are, image one, image two, image three. So it's pending review at the moment, but you, you, the way you do it is you have this lead form. Now after a day or so, we'll see um, how many leads we've got and you'll have to download them into a lead form. Now because I have uh, Zapier, it's kind of useful. Uh, I can create a, a zap, uh, which is very good. Um, and let me see, I'm going to edit, I've got one here that I set up previously. You have, there is there's a free version of Zapier, but the one that you'll need to get the Facebook lead is um, a paid for thing, it's a premium. So unfortunately you'll have to pay for that, but just so that uh, you, you're interested. You connect your Facebook ads campaign here. Um, so this is oh, Facebook. Uh, you say new lead. Okay, this is where you connect your Facebook campaign. And here we want we want the 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 Weasley's form copy. Continue. All right. Test successful. Continue. Now we want to send an email and from Skillful Mind, reply to, and this is the one we want. We want to send an email to um, Joe. So she'll get an email that instantly notifies her when someone has uh, signed up or shown interest on Facebook. So she can give them a ring straight away. So that's really, really powerful. I'll leave me in there because I'm curious to know how it goes. And so that, that's the body of the message. So this will just email Joe to let her know that someone's interested. And I'll, I'll check in my email to see if I've got a copy. All right, so that's all working. Um, so that's it. That's how to make a um, Facebook ad. And we will come and look at this again tomorrow this time to see um, how many people are signed up. But for the okay, so Peter back again, and uh, it's been 24 hours or a little bit more uh, since I created this Facebook campaign, and so we can see that um, the um, ads have been reviewed and have made active. Now, you can see here that actually image 2 has been not approved. Now, I've tried to find out why that would be, because everything else is the same. Um, so it's only the image is different, so I'm not sure what's uh, happening there. But anyway, uh, the other two have been approved and they're obviously running. Uh, so it's now night time uh, in the UK. So this went right through the whole day. And you can see here it reached, uh, it, it did 480, well, 518 total impressions on th with 348 people. So it's quite a, quite a reach. And that all cost twelve dollars and thirteen Australian, so that's probably about eight or nine pounds. And from that, we got uh, six leads. And so, if you do the division, then works out at two dollars a lead. So, uh, yeah, just under, just a bit over a pound a lead. So that's not too bad at all, really. I'm quite happy with that result. And um, each yeah so in order to get these leads now i've got it set up so we get an email when the leads come in so i'm hopefully um they've been followed up by phone call um, but for you if you haven't got a uh, zapier account you download the um you can download the, the six leads so here they are here and bang you can see olverston 
and over here you can see the email these are the important ones the email the name and most importantly the um, phone numbers so I have uh, told Joe to give these people a ring uh, because chances are they'll they ring up and they book and, and then they don't turn up so I think it's really important if you are a leader to just get on the phone and make sure they're definitely going to come uh, to one of your classes all right so we'll check in again in another uh, 24 hours and, and see if we get another okay I'm back now and this is the uh, second day that we've had it running so it's been two night times which is two day times in the UK I think it still is evening so we still may get some more um, interest uh, today just to let you know it's been Friday night a uh, Friday and Saturday over in the UK I really don't know whether weekends are better to advertise or weekdays um, you'll just have to try that out but just just so that you're aware that's uh, where we're at so yeah two uh, days in we have had nine uh, people register their interest and give us their phone numbers and emails uh, which I showed you how to get by downloading this form this image uh, it seems to be obviously doing a bit better than this image um, so Facebook seems to sort that out uh, just interestingly enough I added this image to another campaign and it got approved so again have no idea why this wasn't approved but anyway it doesn't matter uh, the, co the total cost has been $20 Australian so far uh, which works out to about $2.25 per uh, sign up um, so that's two days and you've already get nine people let's assume that at least 50% of those half of those people will come along that should be give you a class of about uh, five people now just one other thing as well um, this is the ad and we have also started to get some interaction on the ad so Jackie Salisbury has already uh, commented yes I'd love to join you and she hasn't actually given us, she obviously didn't press this learn more button, but um, I've actually sent her a private message and we'll try and contact her again. It's great to get their uh, phone number. I can't stress the importance of how uh, much more powerful it is if you just give them a ring and have a chat about how they're going with their meditation. They're much more likely to turn up. All right, well, that's it. I'll, I'll keep this ad running for a while, but I'll finish this video here. Um, and I hope that's helped you to decide whether or not you want to give this a try with some Facebook ads. It's, it's certainly, I think, a very good way to go.